The most privileged and pampered dogs in the world are here in New York this week competing in the fancy Westminster Dog Show. But one of the dogs has a very different story. He was neglected, mistreated, sold on Craigslist until his new owner found him, loved him, and turned him into a triumph. Here's ABC's Dan Harris with the story of Maverick. In a competition where purebred dogs are spritzed, shampooed, trimmed, and blown dry, where they're hand-fed steak, dressed in diapers and bow ties, and followed around with saliva Zambonis. I am like dodging drool, <laughs> like I'm in a video game. In this orgy of canine entitlement, this dog, named Maverick, is an exception. It seems to me just incredible that here we are at the Super Bowl of dogs, and this is a dog you found on Craigslist. That was a rescue that was abused and neglected, and in terrible shape, absolutely. He was so thin you could see his ribs. His nose was infected and he chewed his own tail raw. But Dan Stallings nursed Maverick back to health and their bond is now palpable. I have to say we're in this room full of people. It's like you're the only one here yeah. for him. He's the only one here for me. That's right. Five months after rescuing Maverick. Boy, yes you were. <laughs> Dan Stallings started entering him in shows and Maverick started winning until he made it here to the big dog of dog shows, Westminster. If he wins today, how are you gonna feel? I, I can't even imagine, I can't. That would, that would really tear me up. I'd be so happy for him. As Maverick and his trainer paraded before the judge, Stallings and I watched together. I haven't been this nervous in a while. <laughs> in the end though, the judge picked another dog. Oh, that was it. So he didn't make it. No. Afterwards, Stallings said he wasn't disappointed that Maverick had, in a sense, already won. Hey, there's my boy. There's my boy. This is what it's all about. This is what it's all about every day. Maverick, he said, had gone from forgotten to unforgettable. Dan Harris, ABC News, New York.